Hi Aquarius, it's Elle here to do a quick love reading for you. I hope that it resonates for you. If it does, go over to the website, book your own reading there. Uh, all links are below. So let's get into this Aquarius. Thank you, Lord God, for blessing the Aquarius Collective with a clear, concise message from you. All right, so Aquarius, how you're coming to the reading is the Two of Pentacles. Um, you understand that, that a decision is up in the air. You're trying to listen to your your intuition here. Um, you're trying to, you're still, the jury is still out on somebody. You're still, you know, examining this, okay? Um, it says, um, you know, being aware, even while you're in constant motion, you know, even while things are going on around you, even while you feel like you're being juggled or there's something else behind the scenes, you're still aware of it. Even if you feel like somebody else is being the juggler or someone is putting on an act for you because they know that you're watching because the jury is still out on this person. Um, it says that um, you, you'll still have insight, awareness, intuition, or listen to your intuition. And that's what you're doing because you know that a decision is yet to be made about this person or as a decision is yet to be made in terms of are you going to engage or is this person going to re-engage with you how your person's coming to the reading is the magician so they understand that okay they have an idea of what they're doing or what they need to say or what they don't need to say here it seems as if there's a lot of games and manipulation here it seems you know as i look at this reading um, you both are very intellectual and it's almost like a war of words and a war of intellect and strategy. You know, um, if I say this, then I, if they say this, then I should say that. If they say nothing, then I'll say nothing. If they do nothing, I'll do nothing. If, you know, so it's almost as if you guys could be mirroring each other. If not that, it's just more so, um, somebody wants to win or they want to win the argument and they want to win the upper hand here. Cause it looks like you guys are not communicating or it's very little communication it's communication that goes nowhere it gets nowhere your person as the magician a very powerful man says the magician card this is a very persuasive person too they say the right things they know what to say when to say them they know how to manipulate using language words the magician governs language this could be like a salesman. They, this is somebody who's really good, really charming. They know how to bring about what it is they want by way of using their words. So I don't know. It looks. It really looks like a war of words. You, you, you hear their words. You're listening, but you're also trying to be aware of their actions at the same time. You're gonna. You're trying to make sure that the actions match, match up with the words. The advice here is the Knight of Pentacles here. So the advice is for you to stay steady, okay? Constant, consistent, persistent. Um, be like a bulldog. Leave no stone unturned, no task undone here. Um, no question unasked. Um, it says that a guardian angel could be resting in the midst of this relationship too. Um, you got some of the same cards as cancer. Some of you could be dealing, you got three cards like cancer. You could be dealing with the cancer. Um, it's, it's almost like you're both in your respective corners as if you were boxers and you're in your corners and you're thinking about this, you know, what's the next move, the next strategy, you know, what's your strategy in terms of when the fight, you got the same outcome as cancer, the page of swords. So it looks like there's going to be a lot of uh, spying, prying, trying to gather information, knowledge about the other person, trying to skirt around, getting into petty squabbles and arguments. It's a the page of swords talks about a connection, a love connection being very cerebral, cerebral. That word, very intellectual, very um, mentally um, motivated. Like you, you guys have to. Um, someone feels like you're smart you feel like the other person is smart so it's like a, a, a war of intellect a war of words here i don't know um 
there are no cups cards here oh well at the bottom of the deck and you get the same card as cancer that cancer hand at the bottom of the deck the knight of cups and you're definitely dealing with somebody from your past your recent past here it seems as if somebody's going to try to sweep you off your feet or this is what you're doing um both of you are coming as knights it's like you, again a fight a conquest a conquer knight of pentacles knight of cups here um you guys have not let the fight between you the fire between you die there's no vulnerability there's no closeness there's no intimacy you don't trust this person and they don't trust you that's why it's still a fight it's still a you know an ongoing battle um this is what i have for you aquarius i hope that it resonates for you if it does go over to the website book your reading there take advantage of the text question where you can text the question to the number below all links are below all yeah all links are below if you need to get in contact with me also you can donate to the channel by clicking the buy me a coffee link all right thank you guys take care